Now, one other thing that we're going to do is very, very important. We go to users. We're going to create a new user because this is my admin user. I've got to use admin to run the updates and to install the apps. I'm going to create a new user. So we're going to add our user. The username is going to be uh, me. That's going to be me. I'm going to display name. Or we'll call it uh, me. Password. Okay, I better remember it. Now the the password. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just gonna say me at uh, you know whatever. I could use my Gmail. U dot verb dot ink. Okay, so I'm gonna click that. I I could do groups if I want. I don't need to. That would make him an admin. I don't want to do that. Default quote. We'll just you know. Okay, so I created a user. All right. So I've created. It's creating. There it goes. My user making the user. There you go. Now I've got a user. That's me. Well now I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go log out. Log back in again as the user. So we're going to do me, and that adds his login and password. Okay, there we go. Okay, log in. Start using Nextcloud. Now this is me, M for me. That's me. Now if I go to settings, see, I, I don't, all that admin stuff isn't here. This is ultra secure, see? Okay, well, now I've got me. This is a separate user account. Now I can set up all kinds of stuff. I can do I can do calendars. There's all kinds of stuff I can set up here. But here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to synchronize this. I'm going to open up my Nextcloud software. Now you're using Windows, Apple, doesn't matter. I'm using Ubuntu. We're going to type Nextcloud. Now I've already downloaded and installed Nextcloud. There it is. I've already got Nextcloud installed. You can download, install it however you install it. I've got Nextcloud installed. Now here's what I'm going to do. I've got to take, I need my Nextcloud server. It's this right here. That's my Nextcloud server. I'm just going to copy it. Come up here, switch back. Go there. All right. Now the, notice the S. It's got to have the S. It won't fix it if you don't put it. It's, you got to put the S there yourself. That's the that's the address to my Nextcloud server. I'm going to use login username me. That that that's what I made. Okay, password, next, and there it is. It's going to ask me. Now, this is something I don't like to do. Ask for confirmation before syncing folders larger. I don't want to do that. Uh, that, that that's the thing. Conf extra, yeah, I might want to ask for that. Now, here I go. Is that the folder I want? Yeah, my home. That's that's where I am. It's my, you know, next cloud is the thing to look at there. I can change that if I want, I suppose. Go searching and make a new file. I'm not going to do that. I don't need to do that. Next cloud is fine. All right, so I'm going to click on connect. There we go. We're done. Now I can open up my local folder. I'm all set. Now we're going to go look at my local folder over here. I'm going to local folder. I'm going to open it up. There it is. See my next cloud? There it is. Oh, look. I can open it up in the browser. I'm already there. That's not so important. See, look at it. See, see the next cloud video. Next cloud video. It's a, next cloud's a great video to watch. Got to watch that. But there it is. See the next cloud video right there. Watch. I'm going to delete this. I just deleted it here. Now up here it says it's all synchronized. So I'm going to refresh the page. And it's gone. Okay, Nextcloud Community JPEG. Oh, look at all them beautiful people. Excellent. Way to go, Nextcloud team. I'm going to delete that. Can I delete it? Delete it. Watch. It's going to go. Here it goes. Up here. Should be syncing soon. Well, come on, sync. Up to date. Are you going to, are you going to sync? Oh, my wait a Oh, look there. Okay, there it goes. Took a second, and there it's gone now. Well, that's Nextcloud, and that's how to set up Nextcloud to sync with your local folders. In fact, I can even do this. I can even take that. I can even bookmark it. There you go. Now I got my Nextcloud right there. That's how to set up a Nextcloud account and sync it with your local folders. On any app you're using, the interface is the same.